Guys, this is We The Play D, Brent and Brustrix of YouTube, Pokemon Masters EX. I know, I know what you're thinking, I know, but just hear me out, okay? I am not doing well. It's not even Valentine's Day, but it doesn't matter. I am not doing well. Between not being able to play on Pokemon Legend Arceus because of that darn Cresselia thing, and my upstairs neighbor having such a black heart that is poisoning me inside and out. I need to do this. Besides, this might be the only Valentine's related thing you're gonna get from me anyways. Unless I'm lucky enough or in the mood to look for some Google related Valentine's thing. Boy, that was such a long time ago that I recorded that. But, friends, friends, fam! I know you didn't ask for this. I know you would pay me not to play this anymore. Welcome to Pokemon Masters EX because why the heck not? We are going to do sweet shenanigans the Palentine's Day 2022 story event. Because the only love I'm going to find is not going to be in my own apartment. So, good vibes only from here on out. Let's begin. I see. So this is Palentine's Day on Passio. It's an event for showing thanks to others by giving them sweets, I swear. Yep, that's what I've heard. It sounds like some people also give presents to a person they fancy, too. Wow. I hear if you walk around town this time of year, you can see a lot of couples giving each other gifts. Yes. What a lovely event. Mm. They almost sound the same in my head, but I'm sorry. The only problem is, it's difficult to focus on my training when the smell of baked goods is in the air. Come to think of it, didn't Dawn and Serena mention that they've made something for Palentine's Day before? I want to learn from them how to make some homemade chocolate. Want to come with me? We can make them together. Chocolates? Oh, I couldn't. I I've got training to do. Ross, were you listening to us just now? I got nothing bad to do. If you wouldn't mind. This is a secret, okay? Especially from my big bro and Gloria. <laughs> if you keep it a secret, maybe I'll make some for you too. All right, I'll be tight-lipped. The zipper, <laughs> the zipper broke off. I'm still talking. Oh well, jokes aside. Let's see where this story takes us. We are Team Heartbreak. Hmm. What are the odds that they're gonna be wearing masks like Team Break? Am I... Am I correct in this assumption? Because there's no way it's gonna be a brand new team. There's just no way. I know this game's better than that. Ugh! There's couples everywhere! Con it! We all called it. We can't just sit by and watch this! Come on! Somebody's gotta take a stand and fix this nonsense! Oh good, you're gonna be poisoned too. Great. Hey! Oh, hey! That guy just stole my present! Aw, oh, thanks. I'm sure I'll love it. Wait. This has somebody else's name on it. Oh, that's not the person I made for you. How'd it get swooped? Or swapped? <laughs> Mission accomplished! There's just people that live to make other people miserable. Including my neighbor! <sighs> Sorry, I know I said bad bot. It's over, but... <sighs> you have no idea how much I just need to let it out. I really gave this chocolate making thing my best shot. I mean, I'm extra sweet. I sure hope they like it. No way! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the chocolate, sucker! 
Yeah, go get him, Marnie. We're the champions of justice, one person. Out to save the world from this twisted trash tradition you call Palentine's Day. I mean, what's a pal anyways? We are Team Heartbreak. You'll see, we're going to wreck Palentine's Day for everyone. <laughs> Where do you weirdos think you're going with those? I don't know, the dump it off a cliff? I thought I saw them run this way. <laughs> hey sis, I have been looking for ya. La la, that joke never got old. <laughs> oh hey! Brimbush said he saw you earlier, so we all came to find you. I wanted to sing you a song for Palentine's Day. Oh, that sounds amazing. I'm just, I'm a little tied up at the moment. You haven't seen any weirdos around here calling themselves Team Heartbreak, have you? They stole the presents I made. Then they prattled on about how they're going to go out and wreck Palentine's Day or something. I put a lot of love into those presents, and now I gotta stop the love. Okay then. Okay, I'm back. I'm probably gonna have to leave pretty soon as well because I'm standing at a bus stop. I uh, had a few things to take care of, like talking to my brother about coming over and getting it. It's just that. I I'm not even gonna talk about the context of that. So, that's what happened. Don't worry, sis, no need to be sad. None of that! Cause your big bro's gonna find those punks and teach them a lesson. Really? You'll help me out? Hi. Course I will. You lot don't mind coming along, do you? Uh -huh. Almost starting to do a western accent, sorry. No, not at all! Yeah. Let's split up and find them. Gloria and I'll go this way. I'll, I'll go this way, I'll, definitely doesn't sound French at all, whatever language this is. Okay, Pimpus, I'll be with you then. Right. There's no way I'm letting those jerks keep my Palentine's Day presents. Excuse me. Oh, you two seem a bit flustered. Is everything all right? Migano, <laughs> I don't think I used that word correctly. Um, actually, some chocolate. What? Chocolate? Who said anything about me sneaking out the chocolate? Uh, no, I was just saying someone stole the chocolate I made. They really aren't making it less obvious, are they? Uh, oh, I see. Hey. Hang on, someone stole your chocolate? Yeah, hear me out, will ya? completely unacceptable. No. You worked so hard to make that chocolate, and they've gone and stolen it? Unbelievable. I want to help you find them. Thanks. Thanks, Bay. <laughs> I'll have to hold off on finding my own dessert until this is resolved. Hmm? Did you say something, Bay? It's nothing. Don't mind me. Right. Let's go catch Team Heartbreak and give them a good scolding. Come play! Now comes the bell, except that there's a bus already here to pick me up, so the bell will have to wait! Or I'll just skip it entirely. We'll find out when I catch you in a flash! Are we good this time? Is there anyone in front of me? Anyone behind me? No? Is someone going to call? Is COVID going to go and mess something else up? Okay. We're good! We're good! Let's just do this. The more I get distracted and sidetracked, the less happy I become. So let's just get this done because I've got several other ones to do after this. And this is the only thing I feel like I can spend my time on.
that won't get completely blown up in my face. Sweet shenanigans! I did not do the battle. I am sorry. I was busy playing Pokemon Go. It's Hop It Day, technically. So, Hop It Community Day. So, yeah. We're just gonna have to do a community question again, I guess. So, community question this time is... Who are you giving a valentine to? You just keep it simple. That's a community question. So, let me know. Forgot the pass auto. Let me know in the comments below who your valentines are. They don't have to be love interest. It could just be friends. It doesn't matter to me. It's called Palentine's Day for a reason. How I did not grasp the whole pal in Palentine's the first time I recorded one of these, I will never know. I could be pretty dim. I mean, I didn't know I was supposed to go to that Moon View arena in that one game, so yeah, I can be dim. Well, enough about me. It's time to resolve their problems. Grab the Palantine's gifts. Stop Team Heartbreak. And say Palantine's Day for everyone. Now, where'd they go? Hey, look over there. Huh? Oh. <laughs> it looked like a diver's mask to me, but... Yeah, that's that's definitely one of them. Oh wow, still as beautiful as ever. All right. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Uh... Huh? Hey. Oh, right there. Uh -huh. Hey, you're planning on stealing presents from those two, aren't you? Uh huh? Attack! Attack without asking anything! Wait! I've got no idea what you're talking about! Honest! You're not a member of Team Heartbreak then? What? Uh, who's that? I may be in Team Break, but I don't know nothing about Team Heartbreak. I swear I just now got it. Team Break, Team Heart... See? I am dim! Jeez. The fact that you're in Team Break makes you rather suspicious. Uh. Yeah, why were you watching that sink pair anyway? <sighs> I was trying to figure out the best way to express my thanks to them. You see, they helped me out before when I was injured. They didn't run off at the sight of your Team Break mask? Uh. Well, I wasn't wearing it when they saw me. My mask broke when I got hurt. I was in a nasty mess, but they carried me all the way back into town. I was in such a beautiful gesture, you know. It was a beautiful gesture. I mean, I was completely awestruck. Well, I guess that makes sense since they were so kind to you. Excuse me. I don't know. I feel like any decent person would have done the same. All right. Are you kidding me? <laughs> She's the most angelic creature I've ever seen. <laughs> Sure. Nice. Look at the way her mane flutters in the wind, you the Ponita. Um... And those soft red flames glowing with warmth and kindness. Hey! Uh, hang on. So when you said you were awestruck, you meant... <laughs> the Ponita, of course! I mean, who wouldn't be over the moon after an angel like that practically saves your life! I... Uh, okay... Well, that certainly wasn't what I was expecting to hear. But I suppose Palentine's Day is all about showing thanks to those you care about. True, it sounds like it was a pretty life-changing moment for you. <laughs> I'm just gonna be all bashful over here. I get why you'd want to give them a proper thank you. You can do it! But you need to stop worrying about so much. Just march over there and tell them how you feel. What if they get scared of me because I'm in Team Break? No, 
Forget about Team Break for a minute, all right? Just go over there and be yourself. Yes. You could also take off your mask, just saying. It's not glued to your face. I agree. I think you should... <laughs> I didn't read the line, okay? I didn't t take off the dang mask! Walk up to them and tell them! But I'm in Team Break. I can't just betray my comrades like that. I do want to thank them, though. Oh, what do I do? Once you're ready to say something to them, come see me, all right? I'll lend you a hand. But if you get up to any trouble with Team Break, I won't be so nice. Come on, let's go. You've got this. Yeah, you've got this. My eyes on you. What do I do? Oh, 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 nope. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. That place is someone nearby. I don't care, I'm not gonna stop recording. Time for another battle! No one asked for it, but whatever. So we should do a second community question. What is your favorite dessert to have on Valentine's Day or Valentine's Day or wherever the heck you celebrate? Heck, I could even ask about the Super Bowl for all I care because apparently the Super Bowl and Valentine's Day are going to be back to back this year. Wasn't expecting that, that's for sure. Whatever. I will roll with the punches. I will adapt to the situation like I do every single freaking week. But again, enough about me, my problems. It's easy for me to just go on the tangent about like anything, honestly, but if you are watching this video, I don't want the tantrum to be just the only main focus here. This is about love and stuff. <laughs> I hope I just titled the video Love and Stuff. It's so vague, but just vague enough to be perfect, I think. No traces of them whatsoever, huh? Where would they even hide? Well, why don't we try a different approach? Maybe instead of looking for them, we could get them to come to us. Come to us. Talk English, but now you're talking English. Here, I got an idea. Oh my! What? A Valentine's Day battle featuring Leon and Diantha? <laughs> Yeah, after the bow, they're even doing a meet and greet with their fans. Oh, I have to be there. I'd love to give Diantha a present. A Valentine's Day battle? No, I can't be thinking about that. I still have to decide what to do. Okay, I'll see you later then. Oh. Bye. Bye. Oh. Tea break? Oh no! Hope you're ready for Come on, Ponita! Let's chase him away! <laughs> nice. Nice. I, I like that transition. What's wrong? <clears throat> Weird. Why do I get feelings that I've seen that guy before? At least nod your head or something. They saw me, but I got away somehow. <laughs> got the flashbacks of the Ponita. Look, I don't blame the guy. I do the same thing with my Pokemon in an RP sense. That look in Ponita's eyes. Did she recognize me? And because of that, she let me go? Even though she knew this time that I'm in Team Break? I mean, it's a little hard to see your eyes under that mask and goggles. He's wearing both, guys. I could see the strap. 
Why did I spend so much time worrying? I have to tell him how thankful I am. Cool. Still can't see your eyes though. Right. The time to bow has come. Vanillix! I've been wondering, why do you partner up with Vanillix? Yes. I was close. It's to train myself to resist temptation. I met Vanillix when I was training on a snowy mountain. Vanillix! I've been training myself to resist craving sweets, even when faced with such a yummy looking Pokemon. Could it be that you've got a bit of a sweet tooth? Hey there! Oh my gosh! I think I know you! The guy from Daybreak! You finally made it! So you've decided what you're going to do? <laughs> yeah, I gotta be honest about my feelings! What? Suddenly I changed his voice, sorry. Okay, all that's left is to get them a present then. <laughs> How about something sweet? Uh, sure, I think making some chocolates might be nice. Chocolates, yes, that's an excellent idea! Okay, please let me make them. Right. Sure thing. You can do it. I could teach you how to make the sweetest chocolates ever. You've got this. I'll help you out too. And uh, team heartbreak? <laughs> Is this still part of the plan? Hey, could you two help me out again? Okay. Yeah, leave it to us. Oh. Uh. Looking good! Looks like the clouds I picked out match you perfectly! Thank you so much! Thank you for your help, Serena! I was able to walk around town without being recognized! How is that possible? <laughs> Always happy to help, but honestly, look at how cute you are! What? Uh, really? Right! Alright, let's get started on these desserts! No way! Complete! Till the next battle. It's time for the third community question. But you know what? We're gonna make it super interesting. Make up your own. <laughs> you write down the community question this time, okay? You write down a community question, not just to me, but to everyone else who sees it. So it's not really a community question again. It's more of a community assignment. Write down your community question that you wish for me to answer as well as other people who find that question. I challenge you to do it. Show me that you even care about this. Not, not just the veil, just the whole community question thing. I'll say this because I'm not sure how many people are going to see it, but at the same time, those that dedicate to my channel will see it. I want to do the whole community question thing completely different the next time I'm able to update my channel. Like, I have a very strong idea how I would do my community questions. And they wouldn't be just so unpredictable or... Well, predictable. <laughs> I'm not sure where I was going there, but it would be a little more organized. Let's just say that. Time for the sweet heart present. Oh, wait, this is actually happening? Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, come on. Where's your frilly outfit, Leon? You don't think he could pull that off? You live up to your reputation, Champion Diantha. <laughs> I'm also happy to face an opponent as fierce as you, Leon. <laughs> well, it looks like they're gonna bow for real. Yeah. Fine by me. If they're enjoying it, it'll be more convincing play. <laughs> that works in our favor. Ah. <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah, there she is, and there they are.
Guess which one I'm more happy about. Give me a break. A Palatine's battle! We're gonna see all those presents from their fans down to the very last one! Bingo! Huh? We know you're planning on making a mess out of this match, but we're not gonna let you do that! Uh, no need to deal with these brats! Let's go! Wait, I thought you said... Huh? Oh my gosh, it's that guy I know. He's just called Swimmer. Oh, you're that guy who was injured that one time. Hey, aren't you one of us? Where'd you put your mask? Why is the phone ringing now? This has got to be the last interruption. It has to be. Where'd you put the mask? Wait, you're in team break? Let's do this. Come on, let's... We gotta help him. Hey. Wait. Let's wait for the, him to say what he's gonna say first. Just watch. Seriously? What? So he's like a traitor? Let's punish him. Hey. I'll have to ask you to refrain. If you truly are that hungry for a bow, we'll take you on. Uh. I won't let you lay a single finger on them. <laughs> Look at you! You're so scared, your legs are shaking! Hey. Pull it together! You know what you want to say, right? Y yeah, I have to say it! You can do it! I believe in you! My cheers will really get you going! You've got this! Go! 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 I'm gonna stop now. Uh, this isn't working, is it? Hang in there. Oh! Like a swimmer takes to water, it's time for a quick swim. Crazy! <laughs> we won! Well done! Lead the rest to us! Yeah, might want to start running now. It's over. How can they look like they yet be so strong, English? Don't let your guard down just because we're cute. We'll eat you right up. My heart and mom I was fierce and cute. And get back the darn gifts so at least one of us can be happy. Or most of you can be happy. I don't know about myself, but the rest of you can be happy. Our match got canceled, so we'll have to it another day, huh? Well, even if everything did go according to plan, it's a shame we couldn't finish our battle. It was just getting exciting, too. Hey. Hmm? Hello, love. I'm such a dork. I'm glad we're both safe. Um, so you're in team break? Uh. Hey. Put that aside for now and try to see the person behind the mask. Hmm. Hmm. Thank you. Thank you for your help just now. My bad. No, I should be thanking you. Thanks much. Thank you so much for helping me when I was injured. Given it's Palentine's Day and all, I wanted to do something to thank you. Oh, so you made chocolate for me and Ponita? Mm. I'm sorry, but my Ponita actually isn't very fond of sweets. Oh, I didn't know. Aww. <laughs> Ponita's eating it? I've never seen her eat something sweet with such gusto. <laughs> Whoa, I'm so glad she understands how I feel! Are you gonna confess to the lady that you're not into her, though? Aw, oh, why do they get to have all the fun? Sheesh. If you want presents that bad, I'll make you some chocolates, okay? But you better shape up. What? Presents? For us? Why, thank you! Yippee! Thanks! I promise I won't do anything bad ever again! I do not believe you. <laughs> I sure hope so. 
quickly moved on to hearts of fickle souls. Hey! By the way, what happened to those presents you stole from me? Sorry, Uh, sorry. I couldn't help myself. They look so tasty that I ate them off. What? Uh. Oh, no. Um, Big Bo? Gloria? I'm sorry. And actually, the presents they stole were supposed to be for you two. Huh? Really, sis? So, you really were planning on giving me some chocolates. <laughs> well, that's too bad, huh? I know it's disappointing not to get a present. Well, actually, I've gotten a present, haven't I? It's not something that I can eat, but I definitely felt those feelings Marnie was sending me. <laughs> you know what? Me too! I'm just happy to know how you feel, Marnie. <laughs> oh, cut it out. You're embarrassing me. I suppose our little mission to spread the thanks of Palentine's Day was a huge success. <laughs> Seems so. Why do I always have to deal with these sweet, soft-hearted feelings? Seriously. Your words are so sweet. They've even started to melt my heart, Marnie. Sweet things are the best. Yay for sweet things. I'm just going to go back to my apartment nice and bitter. That's how I'm going to end this off. Don't worry. I'm going to have a way more fun tomorrow during... The Super Bowl, technically. And for my own Valentine's Day, because I'll be spending it with people I love. Not my neighbors. Or at least the upstairs one. <sighs> there I go again. But again, I will be having my own fun. My own support team. I think I lost my train of thought. I'll be spending Valentine's Day the way that it works out for me. With my friends, fans, and fam. Do RP with me. And that's it. Until then, and until my next episode. What a transition that was. This has been We The Play. Glad I actually did this at all. And I hope you enjoy your day. Take care out there, and I will catch you later.